Hi everyone, just thought I'd share this pretty useful Teams tip that I came across. And now that a lot of us are using Teams these days, I, I hope you'll find it useful too. Uh, and I'm posting this to the Teams tips channel that Mark Smithers from DSC created. And I know I've benefited from the Teams tips he's shared here. So here we go. What we're going to learn is how to create a mini team of sorts uh, so that we can easily collaborate on a particular, possibly short term project. So I'm here in my Teams app. So this is the desktop version of the app. Uh, I'm sure you can do this on the online version as well. Uh, so I'm in my Teams tab here. First thing I'll do is go to my chat tab there, come up here to new chat. And then I'd hit this little drop down arrow here to show what options I've got here. So first thing I'll do is type in uh, a project name. So let's call this test project. And then you'd start adding uh, the team members that you wanted as part of this mini project, uh, mini team, so to speak. So I'll add a couple of um, uh, service email addresses that I have access to. Uh, so that no one's uh, being hurt in the making of this video or being disturbed rather. So once you've added your invitees, you need to have your, there's no create or submit button, so to speak here. So you just need to have your cursor next to the email addresses that you've added and just hit enter. And then that creates the group and that group, uh, that chat group will remain in a draft um, status until you start actually messaging or adding files. So which is one of the useful things is a you can have chats about your project with those project team members and the team members can be viewed here and you can add uh, other people at any time. You can also make an instant uh, audio call or video call to that particular group, which is also great. You get everyone at the same time. You can also during that call share your screen or a particular application. Uh, you can then share files as well. You simply click there, upload files, so you can share files that are relevant to that particular project. And to show you uh, a few other features, I'd quickly go over to a group that I'm already uh, part of, which is this one. So here you go. We've got the chat there. Uh, we've got a few files going there as well. And then we've added already uh, a particular website that is relevant to the project that we're working on. And then it's a video project. So we've also added a tab there to add the video script so that we can collaboratively work on that. And you can also add lots more uh, by hitting the little plus button there, other apps that will plug in. So which is fantastic, I thought. And uh, the good thing is that all the files and the scripts and, and the chat uh, history, everything is in the one interface um, in that little chat group there. And what I've done is I've pinned that group. So for example, if I went to a particular chat, uh, I could pick that and pick pin. That would then sort of bring it up there to my favorites. And uh, yeah, I thought that might be useful. Have a great week.